guys. Thanks for coming to my kitchen. Today I would like to show you how I make one of our popular burgers called our PB&B burger. And we're going to start with our ground beef. We have an 80-20 ground beef patty. We're just going to season it liberally on both sides. This helps form a nice crispy crust on the outside of your meat. And we're going to place that on a nice hot area of our grill there. Now while that's cooking, we're going to prepare the rest of our ingredients here. We're going to start with a nice bun. We have a ciabatta bun that we're using. You want something that's going to have some nice texture to it and that's going to hold up to the um, burger and the bacon and everything that's on it, something that'll absorb some of those juices, so a fairly substantial bun. So one of the keys to a good burger is a good bun. So we're going to throw this down on our flat top here and we're going to let that toast. And that's going to help develop uh, some of the flavors that are in that bread. The other ingredients we have here, we have our bacon. And we're using an applewood smoked bacon. It's going to add a little bit of sweetness along with the beefiness and the smokiness of that burger. And then we have some caramelized onions, which is very simply julienned onions. And you saute them down slowly in a hotel pan until they get all nice and brown. And again, that's going to bring some more sweetness to that burger. It's going to be kind of the jelly for the peanut butter and jelly flavors when we get that hamburger done. And then we have an all natural peanut butter. You can use any of your favorite peanut butters. They'll all work equally the same. So let's um, take a second and flip this guy over here. And you can see how some of these charred marks are coming on nicely there. Um, this hamburger originated when I went out west on vacation with my family and we stopped at a little tavern and they had it on their menu. And my mother ordered it and my son ordered it and they both raved about it. So when I got back here to Wisconsin, I thought, well, I gotta give this a try. I haven't seen it anywhere in the Green Bay area, so let's give it a whirl. It's actually becoming one of our more popular burgers on our menu and um, has become a staple all along. All right, so let's give this burger one last flip here. You can see all that nice charring on there. That's gonna develop a lot of flavor with that nice crispy crust on there. Um, so let's take our burger, or our bun here, which is nice and toasted, and we're gonna put our patty on top of that. And then we're gonna add our bacon, because it is a peanut butter and bacon burger. Okay. Now we're gonna add the sweet caramelized onions on there, which, as I said earlier, they're kind of sweet. They complement the salty bacon and the beefiness of the ciabatta and the smooth nuttiness of the peanut butter. So we'll set this here. Um, let me grab some peanut butter for this bun. One thing I like about this all-natural peanut butter is with the caramelized onions on there, it's not too terribly sweet. Um, if you don't really care for the onions on your burger, you can substitute one of the name brand peanut butters have a little more sugar in, so you'll still get that same flavor balance. And we just simply pop that on top, and there you go, your peanut butter bacon burger.